Hello everyone, welcome back to The Crossword. We're going to do the Thursday today. It's a Thursday day. Let's get started. 1950s to 60s sitcom nickname. What the heck, like, was that the I Love Lucy era? I don't know any nick, oops. Ricky, like, maybe is a nickname, but it doesn't fit here. Traveler's item, I guess you might have a bag but that's pretty generic chaps are lads probably um could also be like you know as in chap the lips the verb chaps hmm. they take dedication to write odes probably uh scary story scary story Hmm. Specialty. A person has a specialty, a restaurant has a specialty, an attorney has a specialty, or like a doctor. Your area is your specialty. Wolves, uh, they lope as their gait. A chair might hold one. A gavel. The chair of a, um, like a committee. So, okay, I, I'm okay with bag now. Efficiency symbol in physics. Uh, Ada, I guess? Durable transport for short. I guess they're looking for SUV here. Perspective is a view. Uh, this is not coming out right. Maybe it's just not view. I don't know what ATU blank blank is. Near. Mm, not sure. Something that droops, um, sags. It, uh, I don't know. Nervously awkward. I don't know. Actor Leon, author Leon. Our, our, I don't know. Long distance call. Is there something wrong in this area? Long distance call. I don't get it. Okay, well, no, this is good. Phil is satiate. Actress Elizabeth of the Avengers films. Is it, is Elizabeth Olsen a thing? O-L blank blank blank. The only name I can think of is Olsen. But who were the Olsen twins anyway? Mary, Kate, and Ashley. But there could be someone else named Olsen. Goodwill receptacle is a donation box, probably. Oh, a huff is a snit. Something completely amazing is epic. The Egyptian god of chaos. It's just set, isn't it? S-E-T-T? -T. Totally does the trick. Hmm. I don't think, I think, I think it's just set, and I'm not sure how it's spelled, but this seems reasonable. Um, what about this? Droop? I don't know. Uh, really stand out. Something that really stands out is excels, it's very, it, it, it excels, it's very visible, um... I don't know. What makes the Impossible Burger possible? Fake meat. MSG. I don't know what goes in it. Ain't that good news, I guess. Never heard of it, but it's the only thing that fits there. Train maker. 
Could be a company that makes trains. Could be a lot of other things. Shred. An iota is a shred of proof, an iota of proof. They're both very small things. Korean export is a Kia. I. What? Huh. Well, maybe it'll make more sense when we get some of the acrosses around here. Golfer Poulter with three PGA Tour wins. Don't know. Starts with I. Could be Ian. Not a lot of three-letter names that start with I. Ike. Uh, 2001 comedy starring Reese Witherspoon. Uh, way too long a word for me to guess here. I guess a dum-dum is a dope. Things like hedgehogs are spiny or perhaps spiky. And they're spiny because the Big Apple is NYNY. God, they changed my, my navigation settings again. I'm pretty sure. Hmm. Twice chewed food is cud. Cows chew their food a lot of times. Um, makes the going great. I don't know this old ad slogan. R&B singer Gary. Uh, Gary Busey is the name of some celebrity, isn't it? But I don't think he's spelled like this, and I don't know that he's a singer either. Reporting internal wrongdoing. Well, that's whistleblowing for sure. So there must be some Rebus in here. Like, are we supposed to put owing into this square? Or low in, or low, yeah, it must be owing in that square. I don't know, that's kind of weird. I don't know the state wildflower of Georgia. Chemical suffix, uh, it, hein. any number of other things, really. How about this down? Blood bank, well, they need plasma. Um, really stand out, starts with P, huh? Oh, something that really stands out pops out of like the background. Crankcase component. What exactly is a crankcase? Is it like that? Uh... No, I have no idea. Mounties ride while well, they use various kinds of horses. Police horse. Sure. Pally something, maybe? Um, train maker. Hmm. Oh, Macy? Grace, great, Ma Macy Gray. Macy Gray, that's a person. Yes. And how about this A blank E? Eight, right? A T E. That's the thing that some chemicals end with. <sighs> Old Pat. <laughs> I don't know. Like a hot knife through butter is a saying. Oh, this must be I quit. Nope. An Inuit is an Arctic native. 
9 to 5 are... Ah, usually 9 to 5 is hours, but in this case they're odds, like betting odds. Oh, what? This is legally blonde, but where's the, the leg? There's a leg off to the left side of the grid somehow. So here, there must be a wing off to the right side, and we're somehow like describing the parts that a bird has or something? No clue in the title, right? Right. Okay, but this is also part of the theme, so... Probably here, there's like extra stuff. Huh. Well, that, that's sort of good, because it explains what happened to the S at the end of this. Um, you know, you, you would, this, this clue would likely end with an S, not guaranteed, because it could be like, you know, something in the same tense would be like, goes home. Obviously completely unrelated to the clue, but it's the same tense and doesn't end with an S. But most words here, most answers here would end with an S. Now it can still end with an S, even though it ends with a T, because the S can be off the side of the grid. Like arms, or I don't know, eyes. Um, Best-selling game series for the Xbox is Halo. Was Halo a launch title for the original? I don't remember. It was very popular anyway. A small island. Not sure. Uh, okay, so it's not a donation box, but a donation bin, because it wasn't like, isn't Nene like a meme dance kind of thing? I don't know how you spell it. Huh. Act riskily, or what the three answers in this puzzle do. Okay, so this one is the revealer. It's probably, and, and it, it doesn't have the weird feature or something dangling off the end. So this is the last one that does. Um, but I'm not sure how to describe the action that's occurring in these. Shoppers stop, well they stop at stores. They stop at the food court for a meal. They might stop at a kiosk. Card fits here and is related to shopping, but I don't see how it's related to stopping. Corn product. I somehow feel I should know this one. Well, let's look at the downs for a bit. Someone who hooted and hollered whooped. Key near the space bar is, yep, alt. I can even double check, not that I need to. Products of some plants, I guess aloes come from plants. Hmm. Shoppers stop, R-O. Maybe it's not a horse, but no, I mean, police, I mean, like, Halo fits with horse even, so makes a case against, I don't know. Corn product starts with P. Peat is not a corn product. Pears are not corn products. Peas. Did I already say peas? They're not a corn product. I didn't. I said Pete. That's right. Something out of this world is alien, probably. Bluesy James. Isn't it Etta James, I think? A common crossword word. It's worth learning. Trunk. Could mean a few things. Crawl space. 
Well, a playpen is a crawl space, a space for crawling. But then we would have to erase the E, which is maybe okay if I like the other letters. Language with five tones. The only like tonal language I actually know of are like the various Chinese languages. Um, Mandarin and Cantonese both have a lot of tones. I don't know another one. I think a number of like East Asian languages have them, but I don't know them. I don't know any that have this shape anyway. Still don't know this. Something less distinct is something here, probably. Applet. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, since we're kind of thinking this is Ian, I guess I'll pencil that in now. Ah, enough is no more. So this isn't a dope. A dum dum is a dodo. Ah, the repetition is kind of a clue as well. Interesting. Add. Ooh, still don't know. She performed "We Shall Overcome" in the 1963 march on Washington. D blank E blank. I can't think of any singers like that. Um, whoops, get out of here. A little period. Obvious. Um, something obvious. I kind of want it to end with L. Animal in Do Re Mi. What? Huh? I don't understand that clue. There is no animal in Do Re Mi that I can see. Fa So La Ti Do. They might be talking about those as well, but I still don't see any animals there. Informal title of respect. Informal. Hmm. Titles are usually pretty formal. But a coalition is a block. Captain? C A P N, perhaps? You save in an IRA. Gift that much thought is put into ESP is a gift that involves a lot of thinking. Uh, yes, this is Catton after all. A foreign denial is non. That's how you would deny something in France. Trunk is your torso. <clears throat> now you have a T here. Could be a play mat. Then we have this MB, which I guess is not totally out of the question at the end of a word. I still kind of want this to be view, but I don't think it necessarily is. Nervously awkward, hmm, yeah. Author Leon, don't know. Long distance call, don't know. Near, close by. All right, does this C help? Ah, <laughs> um, I'm pretty sure that a scary story is an attic, right? It's a story in the house that that like scary stories are told about. This is an ATV, not an SUV. Bo, Bo, well, no, probably not. Perspective, oh, Beave is in like Beaver? Sure. That was that sort of era. Ah, something work, works like a charm with the arm dangling out. Get it? 
Long distance call. Could be, is it just a deal? I don't quite see how. Is that what lanky means? Oh, soy, yeah. I guess it's lanky. I always thought that was more like tall and gangly, not nervously awkward. I don't know, I'm gonna pencil this in. Is there anything else that would fit here? A, B, C, lackey, no. D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, lolky, no. M, N, lanky, O, P, Q, R, larky, no. Lasky, no. T, U, V, W, Locky, no. X, Y, Z. So the thing is, I might be wrong about lads. Maybe I should pencil that in as a reminder. Ah! But a long distance call maybe could be a deal. Maybe. Oh, a sushi order is a roll. This must be Lionel makes trains, I guess. An oil pat. Okay, whatever. I don't know what that means. We already looked at these. Obvious. Biotech crops, for short, are GMOs. Home of Daniel K. Inouye International Airport. Uh, I'm not sure what language that is. Could be, could be some European language like, well, I don't even know which one really. It could be more like a, a Native American or like Hawaiian thing maybe. It should be American, right? I don't think it's another country. Shoppers stop. Well, a mart, they stop at a mart maybe. Ugh. Very. <sighs> Something's wrong in this corner, I think. Uh, well, on the other hand, to make a case against someone would involve, like, suing them, maybe, right? I guess... Just because these words are, these letters are right, doesn't mean the ones above them are. The S's are pretty easy, and the E seems okay from horse, but the, the other parts here could still be wrong. Hmm. Any other downs we haven't seen? Observe? Hmm. with a T up the hmm <sighs> understanding ask risk riskily would help so much Okay, so what are the things that are not, we have arm, we have leg, and we have wing sticking off the edge. There aren't really a lot of animals with arms and legs and wings, right? 
Usually if you've got wings, you don't bother with arms. Um, so this doesn't... Mm, it could conceivably be some single animal behaving in an odd way, but it doesn't seem that way. So maybe this is, you know, metaphorically describing a way that anyone, you know, go out on a limb, for example. Got it. Got it. That's how you ask, act riskily. Okay, so Oahu. Uh, some plants, as in factories, make autos. And it was Mart. Oh, so, yeah. Oh, I'm oh so tired. Uh, corn product starts with P. Still don't know. Observe. Note. You note something if you observe it. Up the ante is a thing you can do if you're playing poker. What is this P O N? Deer. Ah, a doe is a kind of doe, a deer, uh, a female deer. Get it? Okay. Um, uh, something obvious is clear. Oh, I've heard of pone. It came up in a crossword like a couple months ago, right? It's like a kind of bread, apparently cornbread. A small island, is that a, is that a K? Then this could be play mat. Thai is a Southeast, sorry, is in an East Asian or Southeast Asian language. Okay, something less distinct is hazier. When doubled, oh, is it just N-E-E? -E? Not sure. Watch me something, watch me nene. That's like, that's a meme, right? I'm not making this up. She's, she performed, oh, I still don't know. Pan Am though, is uh, an old airline and they, they would make an ad like this. Adelie? Sure, I guess that sounds kind of like it could be a flower. Um, I'll pencil in this N for lanky. Arts, arms, I don't know. Long distance call. <sighs> Droop. Droop has got to be very useful in figuring this out. Droop. Four letters ends with T. I think with T is so weird. So maybe it droops is kind of growing long. It's Losing elasticity. <sighs> hmm. All right. Well, let's go do the mini just for a quick break here since I feel a bit stuck. 2019 box office bomb described as a clawful mistake. Don't know. Thwack as a fly, you swat flies. Constantly zoning out, um, you're tired, but that's urban green space, a park. Owner of Buzz and Woody is Andy. Channel for political junkies is C-SPAN. Oscar or Tony, those are awards. Far from high class. Not sure, actually. Pig, pig pen is a sty. Business with lots of white robes, a spa. Cats, okay. And spacey is zoning out. 
I don't know why, but for some reason, I was thinking of uh, like a a stage production, not a, not a movie. Not sure why. <sighs> okay, well that doesn't help. I still feel stuck on the crossword. <laughs> Uh, it's not neat. <laughs> Is there something we could put here instead of an L like that would make this not want to be an N anymore? Because I don't under, I don't like Lanky very much. I'm actually I'm gonna look up Lanky. It's sort of cheating, but that's okay. I just I want to know what it means. Ungracefully thin and tall. Yeah, so it is what I thought it was, and it's not nervously awkward. So I think this is not L. Wacky? No. Long distance call. It doesn't have to mean like a phone call, right? It could be, um, I don't know, if you were at a golf course and someone made a drive that looked really good, you might call, like, oh, calling it, it's going in the hole, for example, right? Um, I don't see exactly how that would apply. My point is just it doesn't have to be a phone call. Or it could be like a sound that, that is made by, say, an animal to attract some other animal, a call. And on that note, it could be a yell. Right? Yes, it's a yell. Because then droop is wilt. Someone awkward is gawky. Chaps are guys. I wanted it to be more English because they don't really say chaps here. Maybe they say guys in England. I don't know. But this should have been hinting at a more English uh, word, I thought. Um, the problem is there's still two letters in in Adelie that I don't know. I'll, I can put a Y there, but it's still wrong. I blank N. Earn? I don't know. I think it kind of has to be A, right? Could be an I, nine I. That doesn't make any sense. Did I already try an A? I don't know. A E I O U. Hmm. Is it possible that I have this right and something else is wrong somewhere? Once we got go out on a limb, this whole area down here started making sense. I remember for a while it looked wrong, but now it looks good. Be even view. URIs? Uris? Leon Uris? I guess it's a. it could be a name. It's a weird one. Works like a charm. Hmm, this all looks pretty good. I'm just gonna ask it what I'm wrong about, I guess. We're not gonna get this one without uh, 
without some help. Oh. All right, we also have this wrong. Really? Oh, it must be an oil pan. I don't quite know what ain. What kind of chemicals end with ain? Can't think of any, but I'm not a chemist. A dum dum is not a dodo, but something else. Oh, an azalea, a bozo. Bays is a name I've heard of. Yeah. I see. Okay, well, this is an all right performance for a Thursday. You know, I'd like to get them right, but uh, can't always. And uh, the the theme clue was fun. It was it was uh, neat to sort of realize that with whistle blowing, and then have that fill in legally blonde, and then later eventually figure out what the theme behind them all was. All right, well that'll do for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.